We just started. Old Wolf. Uh, uh, what, what do you mean by that? Hmm? I mean, if you want me to. What? Eat Helva. Eat Helva out? What are you the fucking talking about? <laughs> Apparently eating Helva out. It's been fucking three minutes. Jesus. You can't. You you may have been been three minutes, but time doesn't stop the thirst. Apparently not. I feel like I need to have a conversation with some of you guys. <laughs> you need a hot shower. I gotta want wipe to away all the fucking filth we're throwing I, at you. Why? What did I fucking do? You uh, you didn't tell me not to flirt with Elva openly. Oh, well, we can we can all flirt with Elva. Yeah, yeah, we can. Anyway. It's actually contract that if Elf doesn't song. get enough attention, he will actually leave the channel and talk to us. You'll get Apple to death and I will suss your channel. I fuck of course. You I mean I I guess I guess I, I miss well, I didn't misread, I just didn't see it. No. Nah, loser. Misread what? Uh, Eldul threatening me. Alright guys, on a serious note. At first I lulled, but then I serioused. It's been three years you all are at it. Three years of what? Yeah, I don't know. It's only been like... A how long have I been streaming for, actually? Oh. When will you guys build that spaceship? Oh, we're fucking not even close to the spaceship, Old Wolf. Don't you? It's like... I'm, I'm building the signs, but Res needs to, to bring the steel over here. Like, we're not anywhere near the spaceship. So just... Just, just set up hell. Just chill. Chill out. Never say We're that. not even all that close to the atomic bomb yet. We, we can't even like. We can't even do genocide yet. How are you fucking? How are we supposed to get to space? I'd be glad Helvet is carrying the team like a mad. To be fair, we probably would have been overrun by now if Helvet wasn't including stuff. <laughs> But, I mean, if Helvet also wasn't clearing stuff out, we'd have more reason to build turrets. So. I mean, In it's saving my resources. Own way, I am manufacturing as well. Yeah, manufacturing you're, so you're turning blood. living beings into corpses. I'm a walking fabricator. The power is going up. There we go. <laughs> oh, no, this is on purpose. I'm um, changing some of the things to make them more... Streamlined. So the communist pocket in the middle of the map hasn't been annihilated yet. Communist pocket. I assume he's referring to the uh, the red cloud that surrounds the factory. It's a big pocket. Uh, where are the heat shields? Actually, I need plastic, not not heat shields. That's what I like to call it's it. It's a cloud. Yeah. What, did you think that this whole area is like bugs? No, this is pollution. This is. This is everything that yeah. we've, uh, we've been doing. Yeah, Why do you see, only have a, a normal inserter picking up the plastic here? Believe it or not, it's on purpose. Okay. Mind your business. Well, it was on purpose originally anyway, because it kept grabbing them too fast and preventing them from getting up here. Right, okay. You'll learn back from the of the black plug. Well, we're, we're being eco-friendly now. We're moving over to electric furnaces. We're being eco-friendly now, me with my giant drill boring into the center of the we're planet. Being what? being eco-friendly we're just fucking burning a bunch of stuff in these. Yeah, so, see, the reason, Wolf, why I have been going on my crusade lately is because that cloud is ever-growing, and if it reaches the nests, 
the bugs will get upset and attack the factory. So my solution to that um, is to kill them before they get upset about anything. Yeah, help us our creative thinking. How is the steam turbines? Because it's... From what I can gather, it's spreading it too thin, but also not removing enough of it. Like, the boilers that are, that are creating it, they're staying full, so they're not producing enough. So I should probably, I should probably just add. change these all to be steam engines for now, then. Yeah, I have no idea. Or maybe it's because they're connected. I wonder if that's causing an issue. Well, we're are we are we like are we good for power? Like satisfaction? No, the satisfaction goes down massively whenever that drill is being used. I mean, last I checked, our satisfaction is actually. Oh, never mind. I need to up our steel to keep sciences going, which has led me to do something. I've turned off the, um... I've shut down for a brief time, putting ammo in the... Uh, piercing ammo into the train. Because it's clearing them out too fast, so no steel is reaching the heat plating anymore. So we're not making any of it, which we need. That's why we're so short on steel for me to use to craft ammunition. Yeah, because you're crafting ammunition with it. Too much ammunition of it. Listen. I don't tell you not to make more ammo because I'm not making how ammo. How are up. things supposed to die if I don't have anything to die them with? Typically you just play Minecraft. No, and I found out what the difference between regular ammo and precision ammo is. What is it, Zaddy? All right, pal. <laughs> regular All ammo right, can done. pierce, but it does less damage to each target. The reason precision da well, the reason precision ammunition does more damage is because it only strikes a single thing. All right, but what about armor piercing that da that ammo? Does that indeed pierce? What do I look like, the guy who knows everything about everything? I mean, I'd hope so. You are omniscient. <laughs> I don't know what is actually going on with these, because they're not even draining water now that I've unplugged them. Oh my god, man. They want you. They really do. Cosmic teasing. You see, I do that, but I'm not allowed to. A fair point. I don't understand what's going on with these. Where is an understanding something? Bottom text. Bless your soul. Look who's on a rope. I'm focusing so hard right now. Sorry. I'm just trying to get these to work because something's up with them. Yeah, you're able to commentate. Oh. Okay. <laughs>
Although I guess they're not making as much much power over here either. Um, Burr is gonna need to look actually. Up a guide. No, cause what the fuck? These ones over here are making tons of power. They're they're maxed out. But the ones on the right are not. And there's no difference between them. The setup is exactly the same. They aren't plugged in, they are plugged in. Check again. Check under your foreskin. Wait. Oh, you're fucking right. These ones on the right aren't connected to the rest of the... Jesus fucking Christ, man. That was that simple. Actually, yeah, uh, it took me fucking forever to notice <laughs> until I actually looked closely at it myself. It's just far enough away from all the power poles you had on the right. All right now, so now the turbines should be working. A bit better no. anyway. All right, so that it wasn't that they weren't making enough power. It's just that there was nothing for the power to go to. Hey, why are they you making basically... enough power? No, we are. We just don't want to. What? They were basically just them? generating power for themselves and not delegating it to anything. They were rubbing yeah. their tummy like, mmm, power. <laughs> Look at all this museum power. Mm. And that's Rez's power balls. That's Rez's balls. You fucking know it. Well, our satisfaction is fine now, even though the numbers yeah. jump all cool over and, the place. Cool and fun fact, Rez believes he can pressure wash people with his balls. I, I don't believe. I know I can. That is still belief. Alright, now the steam turbines are making way more fucking power. Now that they're actually connected to the rest of the fucking base. Speaking, Speaking of Rez's balls. Speaking of Rez's balls, check out the Patreon. <laughs> oh my god. Rez has finally learned that the secret to efficiently generating electricity is to actually send it to the factory. Hello. It's fine, it's working now. Now we can actually run the fucking grill, I think. That, that, that whole fucking network was generating, it was supposed to be generating a shitload of power. It wasn't sending it anywhere. That's why it wasn't making, that was not, that's why it wasn't using up any steam. It's because there was fucking nothing for it to go to. Now it's using steam. Mmm, steam from the steam hams, Rev. Yeah, now it's, ma it's making a lot more than the, uh... Good, the, the actuators are full, which means that... So we actually need the actuators quite badly. Do we? Yeah, um, so by reading the description of the, the umbrella, you need actuators to act as a power source for it. Like, you can't just draw from your own power. The actuators need to be the reason. Because if your power goes out for any reason, it stops. Right. <clears throat> anyway, but I... Oh, I meant yeah, to, that's right. I meant to talk about this fucking... ages before uh, I got invested in the steam turbines and why they weren't working. Uh, we do have a goal to do. Same goal as before, the uh, Stinger Animation brand logo and schedule template. Uh, all of those fancy stuff are the cherry on top for all the overlay stuff. Uh, if anyone wants to help out and can, please do consider uh, donating, because it would uh, greatly help me and sets me on track. All that professional stuff. I won't uh, drag on about it though, because I've 
mentioned it a few times before. Just if we reach the goal, we will force Rez to watch Neon uh, Gate <laughs> Neon Genesis. If we reach the goal, I will show. Uh, I, I've said this before. I think I have. Any. If we reach the goal, I will show up a little teaser of an upcoming Patreon post with uh, with a pink character that's involved in it. Kirby. <laughs> it might be Kirby. It might not be Kirby. Pink is pink is the only hint that you're getting. On uh, who the Patreon post is with. That one pink hedgehog from Sanic, whose name I can't remember. Bob? Hate me. Yeah, that one. <laughs> Bob Rose. Bob Rose. Bob yeah. Rose. I don't think that's that's a Sonic character. You're not a Sonic character. I'm not. All right, just so we're clear. What if? What if he was a Sonic character? <laughs> About to be. Envision Rez as a hedgehog. A oh, no, don't be... worry, don't worry. Just type Rez the Hedgehog in Google Images. Rez the I'm hedgehog. curious now, hold on. Okay. Oh, gonna... I've, se I've sent Rez a picture of it already. He hated it. I don't remember. Oh, he forgot what Rez the Hedgehog looks like. Oh, it's no. burned into my memory. Now I want to see what Rez the Hedgehog looks like. Rez the Hedgehog. The very first uh, result that I got is just green just Sonic, green basically. Oh, Shadow, oh, whatever, fuck you. It, it changed the the result. Okay, no, it was a fat art. I think I've seen it. I can yeah. also see that one. That's... <laughs> <laughs> That's... That's nice. Now type Helvet the Hedgehog. Helvet the Hedgehog. Rez's puppet, Rose Zool. Oh, what? I don't know. Oh. And there's a really awful looking, I assume, fake promotional image for Sonic 3, which has a terrible, terrible 3D render of Shadow on it. Top 5 Hedgehog moment. <laughs> this is a Sonic Whoa. the Hedgehog stream now. I have actually wanted to play the Sonic games on stream. The only reason he hasn't is because he got copyright struck immediately. That's, that's not true. Play yeah. Sonic Forces and make your hedgehog look exactly like Sonic. Wow, you look handsome! Shut the fuck up. <laughs> wow. There's Sonic and wow, the you're pretty hot. So if sometimes you need to stop talking. How would you feel if Sonic walked up to you and smacked your ass? I would... I would call the police. He'd run away. He'd say, they can't catch me, and he just, he's just gone. That's... it's scary. He'd A-train you. <laughs> Jesus. He'd smack your ass and A-train you. Is this... are these underground belts for the steel? Yeah. Yeah, it took me a minute to figure out where those belts actually come from. The good thing the interface tells you <laughs> what the under where the underground parts are. I'm gonna find your underground parts in a minute. Ah. Vega Gamer's Guide to Res. Huh. What does that mean? It's a game. Oh, I know there's a game actually. Apparently, I can't connect the water system to another water system because they're different fluids. What are you trying to connect? I've got a water tank here and a water tank here. No, stop fucking take. Stop, stop, stop. Fuck. Okay, Why did well, you connect it up? I wasn't. I didn't. What? It's not. No, it's not ready yet. I wasn't going to put it in there because it... until it was until it was done. Well, you fucking blocked me off from expanding it any further, so I not With the, With two whole blocks? Yep. I think you're just being miserable. <laughs> Helva, did you know that Rez's favorite color is his favorite color? Oh my god, did you? 
Yeah, true. <laughs> oh my god, did you? <laughs> What does that mean, Hell? This is my favorite color. Really? Did you? Did you? Did you? Is that your favorite color? Ozzy the dog is just Tails wearing a t-shirt. Why are you looking up Ozzy the dog? I I never stopped scrolling on the Res the Hedgehog search. Why is Res the Hedgehog hanging out with Ozzy the dog? I don't dog. know. What is that? I don't make I don't make Aussie the rules the around here. Ozzy the dog is just tails wearing a T-shirt that says "I survived family diner." There was I I I also wrote that in my head. Just I survived family guys. Oh my god! I don't I don't know what that means. I was like Ozzy don't the dog. Don't forget to watch summer. Family Guy. Brian. I'll have you know, Helv is a Family Guy super fan. He will kill you for, for any insults towards family. <laughs> Honestly, I've seen so many fucking Family Guy reruns over the past decade. I don't think there's a single episode of Family Guy that surprises me anymore. Peter, we're in Family <laughs> Guy. <laughs> they, oh. all start, they all start to feel the same after a while. Peter, we're on Red Star's stream. Get out. <laughs> leave! I don't want you here! Get out! Leave! Get out! Get out! Hi. There's a part of me that's glad that we don't have cable anymore. Where's your rock chest? It's up here. This one? Yeah. It's empty as shit. It's less empty as shit now. Yay! Yay! Okay. I got rocks! Yay! So, uh, Helvet, what, what's your, what you doing, Lynx? <laughs> what? You guys are weird. <laughs> says, the, uh, says the freakishly attractive one. Possible be hot. Like that. What was that? Some... Oh, who's moaning like that? My daddy! <laughs> oh, look. A freshly established bug colony. It'd be a shame if something happened to it. Oh, but why are you putting a gun at my head? What's that? Mm. Oh, yes, I love it. How do you like in the new tank? Alright. How do you like murder? <laughs> I hope it's actually quite an evil person. He, uh, he, once, he once stole my ice cream. He did? Yeah. Kind of cruel. He didn't, he didn't even eat it afterwards. He, 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 he hoisted it in the air and then just let a seagull take it. It's like, well, now no, no, neither of us get it. It's pretty mean, Helvet. Not my fault. You have bad taste in ice cream. What constitutes mm. bad taste? Um, hold on. What's a bad ice cream flavor? Is there a bad ice cream flavor? Uh, octopus ink. Have you tried octopus ink ice cream? I have not. So how do you know it's bad? I've it's... never seen that on a shelf. Well, it's because it's like for which Japan. Only. Probably because I, I made it up, um, I mean. <laughs> yeah, last last I checked, you're not anywhere near there. I, he went there I'm, once, but it was for hentai. Purposes. I was going to say, I haven't actually, I've not been to Japan. I would like to go to Japan. I was going to say I'm probably closer to Japan, but that's probably a lie. You're probably closer to Japan than I am. Every, every so often, Helvet looks outside the window towards Japan and is like, Ah, I'm an American. I'm clearly superior. Where's the tut the tutorial thing is not showing me like base game stuff. Like where's the fucking tutorial for trains shit? Train shit. shit. I believe the tutorial for trains is in the uh, tutorial missions. No, but there should be a little like 
pen thing. This the game like teaches you how to do stuff. trains in the tutorial missions. No, I, I know it does that, but there's also like... Um, so why are you asking? Because I know there's one for in-game, like you can open a little tab and it'll show you stuff, like how it does for uh, everything else. God, let me see. <laughs> there was a god, honey, see. <laughs> Helvet is everyone's sassy aunt, by the way. I don't, I don't know if you guys are aware of this. Oh, there's a little tips and tricks window that you can that you can open that kind of gives you some little tips and tricks yeah, about trains. I, I found it. I, I got it. It's the title. You know, tips and tricks. Not very yeah. nice. There's only one tip here I'm interested in. Oh, it's... Yeah. Why do you guys insist on being like this? <laughs> well, uh, it's kind of hard not to be. With your... You might want to... <laughs> Closely yeah. at the rail building tip, it's very informational. <laughs> hey, 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 Helvet, do you want to play Factory with us? Yeah, sure, nothing weird can happen. Mm -hmm. I like how it's just tutorial. Oh, basic. play tutorial. Tutorial's not available in multiplayer. You're not available in multiplayer. Yeah. Yeah, see, like I said, there's a tutorial mission for right, this. Right, but I didn't play the tutorial, too small. Yeah, I can tell. You know, sometimes I think about things. Like, how am I running out of water when we have water fill? Why am I not just using water fill? What's up yeah, with that? Especially when we have a dedicated fabricator that makes nothing but water fill all well, day, every day. Until an asteroid lands on it again, in which case we're fucked. But it's sort of like it's fine. excellence all day, every day. Whatever that was. It'd be like the first over Helvet in this household. Helvet, why why are you so goddamn sexy? What's your secret to your unstoppable sex appeal? I am made in the Lord's image. <laughs> <laughs> I think you mean the Lord is made in your image, Helvet. Don't you? <laughs> God. Damn, how do you have so much ass? It goes on for miles. Miles? Mm. Miles of ass. <laughs> that, that's the name of my fucking album. Miles <laughs> of ass. <laughs> the Grand Canyon is fucking yeah. butt crack. They talked about that in the Bible. <laughs> and then and then God said, let there be hell its cheeks. God's miles of ass. <laughs> <laughs> miles of booty. Matt Booty. Matt Booty. Hey, look, another freshly established um, biter colony. Yeah, I remember them. This one's mostly spitters. They have their. They don't have their priorities straight here. Enemies so memorable, Helvet forgot their fucking name. <laughs> If Helbert forgets your name when he's omnipotent, it's not because he forgot your name, it's because he doesn't like you. And considering the fact that he's genocided all those biters, that's actually pretty obvious. We gotta do what we gotta do. I carry a lot of repair kits these days for every- god damn it. I need to stop accidentally depositing the repair kits into the tank. No, you don't. Right, I might, I might die here. Why? If I slide you 20 bucks, can you make that a guarantee? Sure. Alright, well, I don't have 20 bucks, so try to live there. <laughs> I'm gonna test the, uh... Putting a set, another train... On the construction network. robots why why is testing the trains potentially fatal well because if i haven't set up the fucking because like, he's a fuck up if i haven't set the network right then this train is gonna slam into the back of the other train and i'm gonna why would that kill you oh 
I don't mean to alarm you, Halbert, but just in case, Gazirs like slamming into the backs of things. It's true. Hmm. <laughs> Floret raised no balls. Floret? What? Floret? No, no, Spongebob! Alright. Alright, we're gonna find out if this works or not. I feel like there's a lot of Ooh. old episodes of Spongebob <laughs> I need to rewatch now that I actually understand more of the Ooh. jokes. Help it. it. Oh. 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 How do you work, little friend? Hello. You know, you're getting dangerously close to the back of that train there. Well, it stopped automatically. It's fine. Now I need to make five more of these wagons. Yeah, you do. Die by apple. That is kind of mean. Uh, not it would take a while. It's possible. Um, yeah, but it would take a while. Because here's I built a tiny bit sturdier than the normal person. I built different. Yeah, sure, it'll take a while. Statistically, Gazirs are blue. But not all. Why? Because it gets funny. It's funny. Well, we get bruised apples and a bruised res. It's a bruised blue nana from Chowder. Bro forgot about the bruised blue it, It's nana. been fucking ages since I've actually watched Chowder. Yeah. And? Fake fan? I, I didn't say I was a fake fan, I just said I haven't watched it anymore. Well, you wouldn't admit you're a fake fan. Who would admit that they're a fake fan? <laughs> well, this probably didn't even need to be a supersonic locomotive. You're only realizing that now. Yeah. Yeah, he arrives late to the party often. You made a supersonic train that travels ten feet. <laughs> it does it very fast. There's a joke to be made here somewhere, I just can't figure it out. And you already knew how fast regular trains went long before that one ever hit the rail. I you just wanted to have a supersonic train. I did, I did want a supersonic Can you blame me? They're really cool. No, but he just wanted an excuse to talk to you for a little bit longer. He misses his time with you. He, he wishes you'd call back, but you just don't. Yeah, huh? What are you gonna do? <laughs> it's a hell of it, I wrote you, but you ain't coming. <laughs> Trying not to knock down too many of these trees. Tree. I'm very afraid of what I'll have to do to the bugs if the pollution spreads any faster than it currently is. You're not afraid. You for might them. don't fucking lie. You might have to intervene. Indeed, might have to intervene. Hmm. I don't like that unexplored land where pollution is going. I'm gonna go take a peek. He has he has a true adventure spirit. Right, now this should hopefully work. 
I think, okay, I've set it up so now that there's two trains on this network. So when one leaves, the other should go to unload. Hopefully. I also need to change this about so it, uh... I know, no square. Okay. What? Oh, it's an attack, I need to get in front of him. Okay, then. Someone got kicked from the car of the fucking stream somewhere. Probably. <laughs> Except for I pronounced it wrong. Mm. Yeah. No! Son of a bitch! Oh, there you have it. You don't, uh... Don't get in front of us. Did it just kill him instantly? It's, that's exactly how it happened. Oh, we need concrete for the warehouse. How big is the warehouse? Is the warehouse what you've got in front of your... Okay, they're quite big. Yeah, they're the, um... They're, they're what I'm keeping everything in when, when they're smelted. Right. You know, my next... Oh, I'm starting to like. Why does that happen? Because you like them. I like lagging. I don't know why it does that. We should get res to play Kerbal. Kerbal Space Program? Yeah. You know, that'd be fun. I just, I have a feeling I'd be very bad at it. Yeah. I tried playing Kerbal Space Program. Once. I never achieved orbit. I did, however, nearly send Jeb into the void of space with no way of retrieving him. Everyone is bad at it, that's the best part. Hi, Wizzy. That's so funny, huh? <laughs> how much is it? I don't even know how much Kerbal Space Program... Uh, isn't Kerbal Space Program... Fuck, look at... Fucking what? Jesus Christ. When you figure out the pronunciation, we'll answer that question. Kerbal Space Program 2, I'm pretty sure, is dead. I mean, a lot of things dies, but it was never living in the first well, place. Well, no, I think as in the developers of the second game have, uh... ...been shut down. I see. Also, no one moment. liked... Kerbal Space Program... Fuck! Kerbal Space what? Program 2. Like, no one liked yeah. it because it was missing tons of features from the first game, and it was really buggy. That is the cycle of life in the gaming industry. Really successful game spawns an acquisition, and it's, it's the studios, you know, do the same thing but our way, and then it's, it turns out to be a bad idea, and then the studio gets blamed for it, and the studio takes all the flag and gets shut down, while all the people that came up with the original idea keep their jobs and pat themselves on the back with a fat paycheck, you know. If Kerbal Space Program was so good, how come there isn't a Kerbal Space Program too? Well, you see, there was. Okay, but how come there wasn't a Kerbal Space Program too? too? Uh, well, let's see. Well, um, would you just, excuse me one moment. Still salty about Microsoft shutting down Ensemble. What did they make? Age of Empires. Pretty sure they also made Halo Wars 1. They did. Hell of it was. Oh. Well, I had opened they were back. also shut down in the wake of Halo Wars One. Did, was Halo Wars One not really well received when it first came out? No. That's a shame because it's really fun. The original, good. the original Halo Wars was more a grower than a shower to most of its current fan base, apparently. They didn't. They they didn't let them get to the bit where they could hit insignificant So they're like, yeah, this game lasts. Well, to be fair, it is at the very end of the game. <laughs> yeah, and I'm still upset about that. Get fucking slapped. 
mean, I know at first I hated the game. I always liked RTS games, so I was pretty fond of Well, yeah, I, I like RTS, but at the time, Halo Wars was the only game I'd ever played that handled it the way that it did. Res time strategy games. <laughs> See, I, I I appreciated Halo Wars' uh, lack of base building, because when I play base building games... I cried. I want... I'd like it to be symmetrical or neat. Like, I want it to oh be my like... God. What? You're one of those people that insists on only playing the competitive maps because those are the only ones that are ever per perfectly symmetrical, aren't you? No, I don't... <laughs> I don't care about the maps. I just, like... You're one of oh, those... Oh, you're talking about the base. I am talking about the base. I like, I like the base to look like it's uh, something that you could actually work in. Like, oh, you put all the power plants over here, or put, like, the barracks here next to the radar, and it looks cool. And then I realized that, oh, wait, oh, I've put all my power plants together, and now someone just ion cannoned it. And now... Well, well you could just plants. not put your power plants together. But I, it looks cool. You I know. like it. It looks like it's uh, it works. Yeah, and, and then you see the very tangible consequences of your actions. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty base is a good base, not efficient, but looks nice, yeah. Flame tank. <laughs> like fucking GDI and Tiberium Wars had an artillery ability that was at its best when you were up against a player that grouped all of their power plants in one spot. It's like Supreme Commander, you put all those power generators together. Just because of big chain reaction. If it looks cool, it'll track something. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that was always my problem in Supreme Commander, because that's how I built my bases in, in that. I just, I, I compensated for it by, uh, by making them priority for shield generators. The hell of it, you don't need to compensate for anything, you are big enough as it is. Alright, oh. Okay. <laughs> no, I got hiccups. Chat. But no, I, I I grew to appreciate Halo Wars a lot more over time because I I started to see the base building points as conflict points, and the AI is more focused because of how that works. Halo Wars is really good. Like, if you guys yeah. haven't check out the. Uh... The playthrough of me and Sev did on Halo Wars 1 and 2 on the YouTube channel. But maybe I don't want to watch it. And then, uh... And you were sad. And you are snow. It hits the grid. I didn't even realize Maggie had, show had showed up. I noticed Maggie. Yeah. You see the purple names, it's like, oh yeah, that's Wizzy. You didn't, you didn't even notice the moth. No. Oh yeah, at, least, at, least, at least I'm honest about it. I'm, I'm, I'm real. Hell yeah. <laughs> Yeah, how dare. I noticed That's awful <laughs> Rez. Yeah, I didn't oh, I didn't okay, notice then. Maggie, but but Rez yeah. is at fault. Yeah, Rez, you fucking scumbag. How dare you my, not my, notice Maggie? My bad guys. <laughs> it's my fault, guys, sorry. Never trust a blue guy. <laughs> what a blue bastard. Reds are like, oh, okay, then it just starts crying. <laughs> okay, assholes. A hundred concrete per warehouse. Yeah, that's why I carry a lot of it. But I don't have the steel. Well, I'm trying to increase our steel production. 
Yeah, Butane is playing pool out in New Vegas. I sure hope he's not going for the fucking... Get railed in the ass by the Legion playthrough. What have you did? Well, um... I'd, I'd watch. I'd join any of them. They need a new. They need a new fermentari. Uh, I'm in. What What is your guys' pick? Uh, when you play New Vegas, Helvet. Which fact? He's not in the. Oh, okay. He could, he could be. I'm gonna mod New Vegas to put Helvet. <laughs> He's already in the game. He's Caesar. <laughs> <laughs> he just shaved the vid. You know. You know, I didn't need you to call me out like this on stream, so... Everyone then stabbed them all in the bank. If I had to pick one faction without taking wildcard into account, I'd go NCR. Yeah. Yeah. How about you, Rez? I noticed you asked the question, but you're not answering it. Um, well, I've only beaten the game once, and that was... Yeah. Wild card. Um... I think me and Seb have talked about this a fair bit, and I think we both agree that the best option for humanity is house. Dude may be a very boastful man, but he gets results everywhere he can. The reason why I go NCR instead of house is because the NCR actually gives a fuck about more than just New Vegas. The problem with the NCR is they put too many resources into too many places that they don't need that they're that they're struggling. Like NCR, uh, like New Vegas has like as few people as it is because the NCR just don't care about it. Mister has that fake ass Tony Stark. Well, I would argue that a lot of the NCR's problems begin with Caesar's Legion. Remove that from the picture, and they have a lot of resources freed up. Nah. No. Nah. Because at the beginning of the game, the only the first time they learn that the uh, the NC that the, um, Caesar's Legion is still around is when is what is after the Nipton massacre. They're still unable to hold anything together before they learned that. Mm, fair point. Like they couldn't like they sent you some random goober to check on Nipton because they had too few people there, even though it was like right down the road. Like we can't do it. We are we're severely understaffed. We can't. You need to take care of this. They also don't send anyone else until you're already dealt with the Battle of the Dam, right? Well, it depends on the out on um, your they, what you go with, because of course the NCR will be there if you're in the NCR. But like, if you do any other ending, the NCR waits until you've ki you've dealt with the with the Legion. Like, yeah, we're taking over now, and then you tell them to piss off, and they're like, oh, oh, but what if, that's please? too bad. My Please. understanding is that there's also a side quest um, where if you play your cards right, you can convince the NCR to send a full team of veteran rangers to help you take down a, a legion outpost. So well, they're not totally helpless. But you have to convince them, like, yeah, we need to deal with the legion. All right, go you kill have them. To, you have to help them first to make that possible. Yeah, you you gotta convince them. Hey, like I'm doing this to help you guys out. We gotta kill the legion. Hmm. We can't spare the manpower to kill the legion. Did someone run into it? What happened to that power pool? What power pool? The one that's just beneath you. It started flashing yellow for some reason. Oh, I disconnected it for a moment to see if I can improve everything, but no, that one's in too thin of an area. It took damage. How is... Entity is missing repair packs. See map for more details, and that's just that just started flashing. Now that's okay. Yeah, because I put down a damage. Well, that's not an issue. Strange. You got a problem now? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? Huh? 
Huh? You wanna fucking, you wanna fucking fight? You wanna, oh, you I, I, go? I was just fucking saying that it would start flashing at me. It's fucking stupid. That's what I thought. No, I, I, uh, I watched a video on YouTube once that was titled Why Mr. House is Best for the Wasteland. And, like, the entire duration of the video is focused on how much he cares about the city. It's like, all right, well, what about everything around it, though? Well, you can't <laughs> fix everything else there? If, he's, if his main place is fucked. Because he, he says that once he's done with Vegas, he'll, fuck, he'll, like, he says, give me, like, a few years and I'll send people to space or something. Maybe. But, but the, like, because the... we, we, me and Sev both spoke about how the guy calculated the war and was off by a few seconds. Like, predicting it was, when it started. I think it was hours, but still, the point is that dude is a fucking... Dude's l ludicrously smart. Like, unnaturally smart. Like, how do you... Pre this, how do you predict? As so as you could argue, yeah, it's not that hard to predict when a bunch of idiots can, like, fuck it, let's go nuclear. But dude... Yeah figured it out down to the moment. It's like, yeah, I'm just gonna set up this platinum shit. <laughs> you guys if don't I, mind, right? If I remember right, if I remember his story correctly, his his prediction was a few years out, and he ended up being 20 hours short. Yeah. Like, he's one of the smartest dudes in the follow-up ventures, if not the smartest. Like, if I'm correct, his plan was to try to get most of the Mojave, but he could, but due to the time limit he had, he decided, "Fuck it, focus on, focus on, on Vegas." Well, he said if he had the chip one time, then all of the all of Nevada would have been fine. Hmm. I think it was Nevada. It might have been the Mojave. Traveling the Mojave wasteland sure makes you wish for a nuclear winter. Rolling Mojave, you know, right? Yeah, well, uh, you see, I don't follow the NCR because they have fucking weird hats. You have you weird hats. I... Yeah. It's it implies French. that they're French. Old Wolf is French. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not I'm pretty sure. That. Pretty sure the French aren't the only ones on the planet that wear berets. Like the. You know, like Helvet. It's I, I don't remember. Helvet really. wears a nice little beret whenever he goes out. He, he 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 goes on a little pedal bike. Yeah, has a croissant before he goes to work every day. He says his favorite cafe. This isn't slander, by the way. This is all true. Just ask Helvet. He yeah, every just every morning on my way into the office, people can see me trying to sneak a full fucking croissant. Into, into the office to Why start you the morning. To sneak one? You say it's a full a croissant like it's hard to sneak in. <laughs> you get bags like of croissants. They'll notice my croissant. My arm full of baguettes. Uwu notices your croissant. 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 That shit is expensive now. Croissants? Spend that much on croissants. <laughs> uh, I should have done this before. You should have done a lot of things before. Like play Minecraft. Minecraft C2. Mm, Minecraft. Yippee! So Coca Cola, a little Fortnite. Yippee! Wake me up when Bedrock Edition has hardcore mode. The fact that it Wake doesn't is like quite surprising. Supposedly the reason why is that there's a there's a number of of bugs in bedrock that will cause yeah, pretty much unavoidable spiders, death. Normal spiders, silverfish. Okay. <laughs> Alright. 
But in their own words, there are a few bugs in Bedrock Edition that apparently don't exist in Java that can cause unavoidable death, and they would like to patch those out before hardcore becomes a thing. All right, so These... it'll take them 5,000 years. I think their most recent update on it was a few months ago. That's, that's pretty good. You look pretty good. <laughs> yeah, they added it. Crisis. What cosmic crisis? No. Hostage crisis. I, ju I just need to get it off my chest. I've just been thinking about it for a while. The what crisis? The hostage crisis. Who's who's hostage? I don't know. Maggie caused it. Maggie, is this true? Did you take hostages? You know the answer is going to be they were dead by the time they they were found. <laughs> Maggie, did you take hostages? We've talked about this before. Maggie bit me. Oh, I've messed up. Have I? Ah, uh, loser. No. So no I hostages? Nah. Sorry, unwilling observers. <laughs> hostages? Nah. Just willing participants. Yeah, willing to touch your ball. What? I don't know. I'm s we tried to gag help at once. Once. He didn't like that. Yeah. He killed us. The only reason he didn't kill me was because he wanted to make sure someone was alive to tell the tale. And then, and then he st and then he revived Rez. It was kind of, just kind of fucked up. This uh, this crude oil deposit is looking pretty safe. You should come build a major complex over here. Oh, uh, yeah. Haha, <laughs> okay, Helvet, don't kill me. Okay. <laughs> Cups your balls cutely. So can you come? How much inventory space do you have, actually? Well, one, I don't, I don't want to answer the question of if I can come, but uh, I have, a, I have about. Oh. Shit. Why? What do you need? I, I need to move this these iron plates out of the way. I'm gonna need a bigger bag. Just a moment. That is a oh. fucking massive that is a nest. spicy meatball. Jeez. <laughs> Don't care. Don't care. Don't care. Well, have fun, Frieza. What? I don't think we need to, uh, I don't think we need to hit that just yet. <laughs> yeah, I'd hit that. Son of a gun, I'm being invaded by ants and flying ants again. Again? Just just do what, um... His name eludes me, so no. It rains that. ants over there? I'll rain on you. Hey, it's me, Sif. Hey, it's me. Hey, hey it's me, Sif. Anyway, let's get into this shit.
Should I deal? Should I do anything with the sign, or should I just put it somewhere? I'll have it set up in a second. Well, you can't exactly have it set up when it's in my chest. Yeah, so there's a coal deposit over here if you want some of that. How big yeah. is it? It's 5.5 million. That's a, that's a decent, decent amount. Sure, we'll just... I All we have in. to do is destroy the largest nest I've ever seen. <laughs> mm, a, a, a very easy task for you, Helder. I'm certain. <laughs> Give me atomic shells yeah, and like we can that find apples. out. Leave me alone. He uh he doesn't like eating apples. He says they taste too sour. I actually Help really like until apples. He dies. Then why don't you eat any? Because I don't. I don't you just buy let them. them bounce off of your head. You have a fridge. I do have a fridge. I could could get apples. Man apple. loves apples. He's never even tried apple sauce. I ha I th this is not an apple though, so. It's, uh, it's a direct Apple product, though. It's still Apple-flavored. Bro hasn't even tried an iPad. An iPad? Yeah. Well, that was a Mac, but, um, you know, who cares about Macs? I'm lagging on my side, but I'm still here. I occasionally will lag, or I'm not sure what's up with it, though. This is very unkind territory. You guys You're are unkind. being big bullies. Um, says the big blue guy. Um, what's my color got to do? <laughs> Everything. I'm incredibly biased against blue people. What is with these nests, man? Jesus. This is... This is mean. I don't like it. There's another one. You know, I think this is too many. Or is this how many I had before? I think you are too many. What does yeah. that mean? It means under what the gear. What does it mean? It means uh, you're, a, you're the only gazir he knows and it's already enough. Okay. It's kind of mean. Maybe you should make yourself tolerable then. Wow. <laughs> okay then. I guess I'll. I guess I'll just kill myself. <laughs> All right. How's everyone in chat doing? Hey, I know. You mean you don't know? I don't. I don't. I don't know. All right. No idea if this setup is any good or not. Hey, look, a 9.2 iron deposit. That's pretty small. A million? No, just yeah. 9.2. 9.2 million iron. Yes, ma'am. Nice. That's quite decent, I would say. I'd touch that on the bum.
There's also several crude oil deposits not far away from here. Indeed. No, okay, that's actually a lot. You could probably pump those all into the same... I didn't make that one. Yeah, you could probably pump those all into the same network. That, that's just a line, line of oil. Indeed. And aside from those enormous nests, well, I guess there's also the uh, the fourth one right there. Um, aside from the biggest nests currently visible on the map, <laughs> those are some pretty good-looking deposits. <laughs> Did you run out of fuel? I'm gonna make a quick drive back <laughs> to the factory. Not See, confirming or nor denying nothing. anything. Now this should need his power. So, did anyone do anything interesting today? I worked. And, uh... Well, you know what else I was doing? I was in a call with you. Yes. Yes. I consumed food. What? Why would you do that? Consuming it tasted food is good. Kind of cringe, actually. It tasted good. You're kind of cringe. I liked it. You don't see I me was talking about that. Good at it. Consuming food is probably the one thing I can say I'm genuinely good at. <laughs> you yeah, know, he just told us something that we should probably sit and go. Wait, that's depressing. No. He's he's good at it. Right now the iron stuff is back on the go. Now it's got warehouses, so it should fill up before. So it doesn't. So it should fill everything up and then leave. So it's not gonna be stuck around waiting for a single cart to uh, unload. Hopefully. Wait, how did that train move? What train? The ammo train. I removed its means to finish up getting ammo. How to <laughs> do that? You shouldn't be moving! 
train works in strange and mysterious ways. The strange train. Time to go thor some fuel. I totally didn't run here on fumes generated by some wood I had in my pocket. Yeah, because it was in your tank. Indeed. No, any second now we're going to find out if this train actually... So, does this thing... Where the fuck? <laughs> Near the pipe. God the damn. Pipe. Right, I need to make this fucking cool train. Cool train? The guy from Gears of War? Oh god, he's so sexy. I have made an error. Your train has no path. Jesus. The good thing I wasn't standing on the rail, I didn't notice the ammo train go by. Yeah! Almost got hit myself! <laughs> How do I only have one underground belt? Because you broke one of the ones that I had, but only the entrance, not the other bit. So only the exit, not the entrance. Are there any gates on this railway still? No. <laughs> Why not? I like how... There's a meteor point defense at the iron mine, but it's unsupplied. I know, I need to make something. <laughs> uh, funny. It's not mm. funny. Funny. I'm just gonna go around. I'm really glad you made this fucking hole in my wall. You like that? Do you like it, Helmer? Is it just for you? Right now, yeah. So, what did I miss? Because I wasn't listening, to be honest. Um, we're now due to replace six train cars. Sam. The engine was spared, though. I hope whoever made that blunder got fired. Yeah, I think he's angry. It looks like that only happened because of the engine pulling them. Ran out of fuel.
those trucks were full of iron. How much was in each one, do you think? Enough. Uh, 80 stacks of 50. In each one. 80 stacks of 50? It stacks in 50? Apparently. I thought it was more. Oh. Fucking hell, man. <laughs> That's so much fucking steel and iron. And now because we lost all of the fucking iron that that would have brought, we're not going to make any more iron because we don't have any more iron. Yeah, but isn't the one at the West Iron Star also currently gaining some? Yeah, but we're not currently making any right now. It'd probably be a good idea to move the train from where it's probably going to get run over. Probably. It might be, uh... Meh. <laughs> Can you just take it off the track? Maybe put a signal <laughs> on the curve that leads back around. Yeah, I'll need to. I mean, of course. Fighting an ant invasion with such heat. Are you using your mixtape? That is a no. Fuck me, man. <laughs> Dude, but that only happened because the fucking engine ran out of fuel at the worst possible spot. Did you 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 allowed a, a train to get a trained? I'm trying to figure something out over here, but it's apparently not liking the idea. I almost forgot what I came over here for. I mean, if it's any consolation, no. in the grand scheme of things, like compared to the total amount that we can extract from that mine, it's not a whole lot. I guess, but it's still... Well, I want I a mold, did, okay? I did the math out of curiosity to see exactly how much was in those cars. Two dollars. So if it's 80 stacks of 50 to one car and there were six, there were 24,000 units of iron on that train. Still a lot of iron. It is a lot of iron, but in the grand scheme of things, it's not that much. 500. I mean, there's still nearly 4 million sitting in the ground over there. Should go there? I think it goes there. Oh my god. Right, okay. My Man. train wagons are done. And there's over 9 million more sitting about 80 million miles away. That's not that far. But you get the idea. Was one short? So, is there a place that I can get processed fuel from that doesn't feed directly into one of our most important facilities? I will make one. Okay. It looks like the power's gone down again on those folks. Uh, 
But it's not, we're still making plenty of power with them. It looks like it's more a matter of necessity than anything else, because it looks like they output more power when when Sev's core drill is turned on. <laughs> you, know, you, you, you keep you keep talking about my uh, core drill like it's some boogeyman in the dark. It's doing it what it's meant to. Okay, it's doing a good job. <laughs> there's a. I just I, I can't get over that. There's a very noticeable load on the fucking electrical network. You do and it that only happens when the drill is spinning. <laughs> I mean, at least we can, you know, actually hold it now. Right, this train should be working now. Hopefully. This wouldn't have fucking been a problem if I just made it a loop. Then that uses more rails. Atlanta. Are you yeah. still testing the bridges? No, I'm fucking done with the bridges. <laughs> no, just. I saw those splashes. <laughs> Right, now I need to go get this coal. Though there is a bug nest that's not immensely far from it. I can I, like, take care immediately of that. jerk my neck to the side every time I, I hear a notification. Like, is that another music? Oh, okay. There's most likely one or two uh, freshly set up nests in between here and there as well. I haven't patrolled down that way in a bit. Yeah. Right. It is indeed super hot. My ass is not enjoying being on my chair. <laughs> I just want to make sure that this fucking train works. It just takes so long to fill it up. I wonder if there's a better way to fill up trains. What could be better than that? Not sure. I suppose it doesn't take too long. Yeah, for a train that waits until all 24,000 spaces are full, it actually doesn't take that long at all. Oh, we can make laser turrets now. Yeah, we can strap those onto um, trains when, when we get the right upgrades. Outside of putting them on trains, would they be any more effective than what we're, what we're using right now, turret-wise? 
We don't have anything on the trains. The the laser turret does twenty laser damage. It runs only in for the electricity. We'd we'd have no need to ammo trains. The gun turret apparently has nothing. Nothing on it. What do you mean the gun turret has nothing? Well, it doesn't say how much damage the uh, the gun turret does. The gun turrets that we have down currently, they do five plus two point two physical. So uh, a good bit less. I. I'm looking at the stats on one of our turrets against the walls at the very bottom. Oh, okay, so you can't see it from just hovering over, hovering it's over it. Most, the... It looks like it's based on whatever you've loaded into it, so it waits until... I'm, I'm, just, I'm just taking shots in the dark here. I'll shoot you in a minute. Mm -hmm. in the back is going to be like, I'm sick of waiting. <laughs> Fucking hold me up. I, is, is that a train stop? Yeah, it is, I see. This is an armored train. So we want our coal train to carry a shitload of coal. Though I think this is probably not enough room to actually hold all the coal we want. Unless it's on the left, maybe. If if we did replace our gun turrets with laser turrets though if they only run on electricity we could potentially repurpose the existing rails for something else if that's at all important to you and repurpose the rails yeah because if without without the need for ammo at the at the walls because of laser turrets those rails would have no immediate use See, I don't even know if we need this, the armor train. I mean, nothing around here should be attacking the railways. They've no. been all within safe territory, more or less. And so I guess we just build more um, supersonic trains. It's the, the most endangered a train would get, as it is right now, is going to the iron mine, and that's like a split second of being outside of a secured area. Yeah, but we're taking the this train down to the coal. The 3.8 yeah, million the coal. Because oh, our coal I... deposits like sat on by everything. <laughs> 3.8 right there, another 3.6 not far away. You could probably you could probably build a refining facility right in between those, honestly. And so a train that goes between the two and but in trains that carry them for the other? Yeah, because they're not that if, if you put like if you put a station in between those two uh, those two deposits, they're really it wouldn't have to travel that far. Yeah. Plus, we can just use laser turrets and not have to worry about getting ammo over there. Indeed. I'm gonna go to the back and quickly. Prove it. And I prove it. Yes. Psst. Where? Oh! Oh, actually, that wasn't my problem, so... <laughs> no, it was mine, and I sat meteor meteorite defense. Oh. Alright, we're back then. <laughs> yep. It landed just outside the radius of the Meteor Defense Turret. Yeah, it wouldn't have hit anything.
Uh, I can see why Quick Charge drained our entire fucking factory of power almost immediately. Maximum consumption goes from 2 megawatts to 10 gigawatts. We don't have that much to spare. We wouldn't have that much in general. I just love that the consumption, <laughs> like just just the entire electricity layout goes fucking wild whenever, whenever the drill is running. happening over here what's happening over there's a cluster of things that are being labeled as not having repair packs I didn't care about damaged stuff before yeah there's a reason for that you gotta give me a moment Man, weather's fucking hot and I'm not liking it right now. What's yeah, that like I'm over there in America land? Not much better. Damn. I'm ready for uh I'm ready for fall. Welcome back back. What happened to the my stuff washer? I have my reasons. No, and I've started liking it. <laughs> Look at him go! Well, how is everyone in chat doing? People still in chat. Rez, come look, come look at me. You got a little drone. Yeah, he's a construction robot. Nice. He's looking for shit to repair. Oh, that's why. Nice. Does it build stuff as well? Yeah, but I think we need blueprints, and I don't know how those work. I'm trying to figure out how to make everything work, such as being able to make logistics robots move things from one place to another. And then I won't have to worry about the, um, you know, the railway systems. Problem is, I can't get figure out how to make them move shit. They just sit still and wait. Hmm. I've, I've seen that showcase several times on the main menu. A bunch of those robots can construct basically an entire facility for you without even you necessarily having to be present. What does it mean, no path? Is it because this thing here is red and I won't let him go? You're red. I don't understand what's going wrong with it. Like up here? Because those lights are where the train is supposed to stop, no? No, that was the one that was supposed to stop it from... Okay. It knows where it's meant to go. Is 
Is it the train that's waiting in the station right now? Oh, there we go. There was a real signal in front of it that was stopping it. Ah. Uh. Which means that I, which I assume means I don't need two real signals. Just, just need the real signal behind the train. I would put one right here. I don't know if that's going to do anything. Well, the front of the train stops at the light, right? If something's in front of it, I think, yeah. Yeah, that's... I'm, I'm only suggesting this because that would have prevented the Iron Massacre of a few minutes ago. If it works the way I think it does. Although, if this train unloads before... That train fills up. Is it just going to smash? No, because it should go around and then down beneath it before that one goes off. Whoa. Are you sure? I think so. I'm picturing the train in the back just fucking disintegrating the train in front like it's not even there to take its place because there's nothing telling it to stop. And I'm pretty sure that's not how the trains are supposed to work. But that's, that, that's what's in my head. Okay, so I think it will stop if there's some... I don't know. I really don't. But now I'm worried. Hmm. I don't know. How long, how much is that train emptied? This train is nearly empty. It's like on the final sixth of the bar. Ray, stop being worried. What? No, because if it fucking crashes, then I'm, I'm gonna cry. It could be leaving very shortly. I'll sit in it and see what happens. Are you sure that's wise? Yeah. It shouldn't just... it The way it's set up, it shouldn't fucking crash right into the front of the other train. Um, I don't think... Oh, here we go. And then it stopped. Okay. The thing that gets me is that it waited. Um, I I need to look closer at the at the light on the curve now because it's it didn't turn red until after your train had left, which I guess makes sense because it wasn't in the way. Whoa. What? What just happened? I'm figuring things out. Okay, leave me alone. <laughs> Why does that? Is that all popping up because of logistics? Um, it's the upgrade planner. It lets me know what can be upgraded and how. Right. For example, I can make it even bigger. Oh my god. But there's also a deconstruction planner where I can uh, get them to deconstruct, which I'm assuming I just... That's... I wouldn't tell it to deconstruct all of that. It's it's no, it's no. labeling literally the entire factory. No, I made it target one thing for the deconstruction. What you're seeing is the upgrade. Right. Oh, oh, I guess. Hopefully that train has enough in it to sustain itself, to sustain the factory before this other train comes and empties itself off. Otherwise, we might need to extend it, make more trains. Or at that point, just make a fucking conveyor belt, honestly. Why? I think I'm getting it now. I think I'm getting Why it. did I make a fucking train? It's like two feet away. You wanted the supersonic train. 
I did want the supersonic train. You also wanted the bridge, but that didn't work out. But it's like, I don't know why I made... Why Why did I do that? Why, why did I make a fucking... I you, just... you didn't think the train would be as fast as it is. I'd be careful about crossing that. <laughs> nah, it's fine. I don't think we need the fucking train. Honestly, the train's probably slowing us down. I'm gonna steal the train for the fucking... I mean, I don't, I don't know if I would say it's slowing down the production line, considering... Like, I'm pretty sure by the time that train is full, there's still gonna be iron from the last shipment over here. Yeah, but if it was a conveyor belt, it would just be a consistent stream. Oh yeah, I know. I, I'm not. I'm, I'm not saying it's it's the most it's the most efficient option. I'm just saying it doesn't look like it's going to make much of a difference right now. I'm just fucking, I'm done with the train here, it doesn't need to be here. But what are you gonna do? Just make a big conveyor belt, that's all it ever needed to be. You sure? Because the resources are already spent and they, they could be extended. There is more iron out there to be gotten and you wouldn't have to go very far off the current path to get it. What, the, the iron the, the deposit beneath that behind us? The 9.2 yeah. million? Yeah, that 9.2 million is almost directly west. You could almost build a straight line to it from where you are right now. So maybe you could still make use of that station, just not for its original intended purpose in the long term. Well, when it comes to that, then I can just have that train drop off the raw iron ore at this station, and then have it just join the conveyor belt. Yeah. Because there's not enough room over here for um, more train stuff, I think. So maintain maintain the the post. You know, keep the the train can. I don't know, sit in a railway that doesn't lead anywhere for the time being. Well, we can use the train that we have right now to get the coal, because we'll be using the sack. Let's pause. And I don't have enough uh, transport belts, though. Loser. Okay. You know, I don't really appreciate <laughs> that. <laughs> Your subservience doesn't amuse. Man, it shot me with a pistol. The Phallic Express, I just saw that. I thought I could go through this. I just realized I was going the wrong way. For what? I was walking west to reach the tank when I forgot that the factory doesn't extend out that far. <laughs> Complete personal light. Excuse me? It was, it's a small no, aircraft. Thing. At least that's what I believe it is. Where where is that? I 
I can't see it anywhere. You mean the thing I just researched? You're looking for what I researched? Yeah. Yeah, I just researched it. It was a research tree. Well, I'm, I'm, no, I'm looking for where to build it. That is a good question, actually, because I don't see it. Yeah. We have to re so it we have to research a second thing to build it. Your Majesty, there's been a second thing. I don't know why it would make you research one thing just to build it the next time. Mind your business. Alright. Oh yeah. The first one doesn't the first research doesn't yield anything, really? Okay. I just went and checked to make sure I'm not hallucinating. Yes, yeah, kind of strange. That doesn't seem right. You have to research personal light operations patrol craft, which sounds like its own thing. But doesn't that really give you the ability to build anything new? What did the mod creator mean by this? Man, that hell of a sure is attractive. Oh, I mean, um, mod creation stuff. Stack inserters don't work on conveyor belts, do they? You don't work on the conveyor belt. That's not what I was asking. My well. Do you work on the conveyor belt? Go there. I'm pretty sure life support facility is what we would need to counteract plague if we decided to use that. Yo, why are we spreading plague? Maggie's not even here. Listen. The ends justify the means, or whatever it is that the villain in a series usually says. I'm a villain, but I'm not a monster. Here you are. I will cover you in peanut butter. Let me go poke around those coal deposits that Rez was eyeing up. Yeah, he was. Oh, they, these, these stack inserters do work on conveyor belts. Nice. Well, when there's enough, it's actually the one. <laughs> You're a conveyor belt. Right, well, I need to decide where, um, where the big coal train's gonna land. Well, normally coal trains stop at a coal mine. Well, I know, but where is it gonna come that back? That can at? only mean one thing. Helvet wants something. See Wolf being a gremlin as usual. Hi Brio, how you doing? Mm. 
You crash trains together. Not on purpose. It was a mistake. It'll be the last one you make. Finishing up the work date, nice. Ow. For the mistake, wow, okay. Thirsty as fuck. You have any idea how many families that Iron could have fed if we had anyone here? <laughs> I could have sworn that the... oh. I could have sworn that there was bridges for railroads in the base in the vanilla game. No, I don't recall anything like that. Safe has tentacles. Yes, he does. We always have. I'm trying to learn how these robots work. So I'm gonna. Oh. <laughs> this fucking goober. <laughs> hey, how do you how do you do that though? What? Not enough to let you... Okay. Never saw them before? Then you clearly weren't paying attention to the Patreon, bro. <laughs> the funky little tentacle monster. Except for our fam, for many, isn't really a monster. Let's not worry about that. Which post the one with the cowgirl? I guess I wasn't paying attention, eyes drawn elsewhere. Damn. What you making? Well, I'm trying to make a... Uh, a train to go get some coal. Seb is working out with robots, and Helvet is covered in blood. He tends to be. That did not work out. Did you lose the tank? I may have. Very disappointed in your helmet. Not cool, helmet. Not cool. You know how much uh, of Sev's lube I had to fucking steal for that? Mine? Mine the lube. What happens if all three of you die? Nothing. The game just. We just respawn. I laugh at them usually. How, Sev's how much does it cost to make a new one? Well, you have to. What the hell even are those? What, the atomic tank? You see, Brio, we need to lubricate our machines frequently, so I make sure that we have a uh, plenty 
Oh, the SAT oh, one yeah, atomic yeah. tank. Okay. Yeah. Because that one has the Gatling gun and flamethrower, while the other one just has rocket launchers. You. You. All right. Step one. Step one. Fourth deal. Preparing the Krabby Patty. Da, 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 da. Seb, I'll give you a machine to lubricate it. Well, I'm currently working on lubricating these machines. Saves some for both. Uh, you know, if you, in the future, you guys might be seeing Sev lubricate something else on the Patreon. Why are you like this? Let's see. Bros, bros. Ah, something fun, something silly. Mm, well, you know, you could see some penis. <laughs> it's it's advertisement. I'm advertising your cock. Could be a chicken. Bizarre creature, I can do what I want. I don't think the chicken would appreciate it. No, not like that. Well, you know, I don't care. Bro knows I morph. You got a chicken farm? You, yeah, sure, yeah, sure. W whatever, kid. Morphe say. Well, yeah, Sev's a shapeshifter. Sev can take on any form he wants. Namely, uh, some blue pad thing I found. I just think it's cute. Alright, how about the coal train is gonna end up go passing over your railroad, so... We're gonna have and you, to... And, yeah, and you know I find coal train very cute, so you need to keep an eye on that. I can't believe coal train, the Gears of War character, is gonna be passing over my thing. He's so cute, I love him! So cute and funny. Thanks. Can I crush your balls? Yeah. No. 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 We have literally no spare bricks in this place. Get yourself an A tray. Oh no. Hey Rez, what's your opinion on no? I didn't even say what I was gonna finish.
Did you know Gaziz are blue because that's not they're not all blue, but Res like Res is blue because um uh ah. No problem. Says the blue guy. I just have blue hair and pronouns. What do you got? Pronouns. No. Where the fuck am I supposed to get big electric motors as a raw material? Well, you have to Res make is them... a... Res is a res. I am a sev, but then there's helvet. What is what is a helvet? What does that mean? It's a... Uh... You're asking too many questions. The main group, but just one guy. The best guy. I think this works. Yeah, yeah, I love when Helvet said it's helveting time and proceed to helvet all over everyone in the audience. Indeed. Now, wh where am I supposed to get big electric motors? You need lubricant and a machine down there that I use to make big, big motors. Uh huh. If you look directly where I am, you'll find it. So I need two advanced ones. Rain chill, rain, fuck off. Real chain signal. What, what are you making? These are big motors. What are these for? Well, I can use them to make robots. Oh. I see. Those damn bugs are gonna pay. Play. As soon as the fabricator is done making at minimum 25 big electric motors, that nest is fucked. Yeah? T tell me more about it. No, on, don't, don't be shy. Tell me. Tell me about it, Helen. I don't know if this is right or not. Uh, Ouch. Yo! I realize that building these advanced aerodynamics things just helps you get to the point where you can build napalm. I'm just gonna fucking copy that. Get simple on myself. Oh, sweet, you copied something. Cheater. Um, it's give me a moment. Stuff. Where, where are you? You a little while down. All right, give me give me some time to set up a network, dear. Something about D. Don't be shy. Gets me every time. Eight. Helvet will say that and then he'll like let up a large villain monologue and he'll, like he'll, he'll loudly boast to the heavens. I mean, 
Oh my god, why not Helvet? What's what's wrong? Come on, Helvet. You can talk to me. What what are you up to there, buddy? What you what you doing? What you working on? I, I I'm worrying about it, Helvet. I, you you've not been talking to us lately, lately, sweetie. What's going on? Are you taking on my circuits, Helvet? Why would you do this to me? I wouldn't take your circuits for my own selfish desires. I've worked, I've worked so hard on them, and you're just taking them. Especially as there's circuits down here, too. I didn't you, take any circuits from up there. Stop talking. You walked all the way up there when they were right here, sweetie. I have no idea what you're talking about. Come on, Helvet, you can open up to me. Stop talking. I'm trying to reach Helvet, Res. He's our dear friend. You should be reaching him too. I accidentally turned the machine off. I'll kill you. It was a mistake, Helvet. We all make those. <laughs> I'll only make one. <laughs> You're gonna make one big motor? I don't understand the fucking rail signals. I don't get it. I don't know what it means. Of course you wouldn't understand getting railed, honey. Ah! Uh... <laughs> I'm gonna grab some of the water fill to make a pond and drown you in it. Does that sound good to you? You think you got the arm strength for that? Probably. Guess we'll learn. All right, small electric motors. Are we making small motors somewhere? Just a, just a question of curiosity. Yeah. Where are they? We have to break the bit. They're uh, they're being complete. They're being put into places. They're being made oh. automatically, but they're being immediately put back into other resources. Also, uh, there seems to be oh. iron shortage. Iron shortage. Yeah. Well, there's not, because it's packed up. <laughs> I accidentally dug something out of the factory. It took me a second to realize what it was. What did you do? I accidentally completely severed the flow of iron plates. Looks like I picked a whole bouquet of oopsie daisies. How about I'm gonna just stop fucking around, little daddy? Been ridiculous, how it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know I love you, Helvet, but I can't let you fuck around like that. Okay? I'm not a spy. I couldn't help but notice this assembly machine that's supposed to be making small motors is not making any small motors. It's because someone cut out the iron supply, didn't they, Helvet? But there's no iron plates anywhere near here. Yeah, it goes That has nothing to do with me. It sure does. You fucked it. You fucked it up, Helvet. You made a boo-boo. Oh, I see what what's going on here. I, yeah, all, all the iron plates that are supposed to be going here are being swiped off the belt and going down here instead. Yeah, to make grenades so I can throw them at your cute little ass. God. Because so, you cut off the supply, it's only going in here now, Helvet. Hmm? It's your fault. 
take some accountability there, big boy. Come on. Accountability? What's that? It's a word. It's a word you should know. I feel violated. No, oh, don't worry. That's all of it later. We'll get to that. Okay. I see. Where's make it stop? I can't do anything. You can't fight against the tentacle. I'm just trying to make this fucking trade network work. And we're about to find out if it actually... Oh, it does. Oh, it does. I don't Ooh, man get has the, the power, but I, does he have the balls? I don't understand. Find out on his Patreon, I guess. Oh, find, look at the Patreon. <laughs> Follow his Patreon and you'll see his nets. My big blue balls. He likes to call them his blueberries. But then he insists that they're not blueberry sized and he goes on a long tangent about how they're actually really big. And honestly, it's, it's kind of a sold out thing, really. Show them blue balls. Live on stream with a map boy. I'm gonna lose it. Just find it then, buddy. Come on. Oh! I'm sure it's around here somewhere. I see how this works. Not really. All right, landing's being done. Do I need to have a stop to make the rail signals work? Probably. I don't understand. Well, Mike, what's going on? I'm trying to build. I'm trying to build the train network so that if the coal train is is here and in the way of Helvis ammo train, the ammo train will stop until the coal train has passed. I don't know how to do that.
Maybe I make the ammo, the ammo train stop. What's the chain signal for? That's apparently what you need to make more advanced train signals. This isn't just a train signal. This is an advanced train signal. But I don't think I actually need to use that. If the only thing you need is for the trains to stop if something else is in the way, then I would just put one... like, one signal up top and one signal to the right. Is that how it works? I assume so. Oh yeah, it's turned red. Let's find out then. Are you just testing to see if it's going to run into the train car yeah, that you've put in much. the other section? Success. Can we remove it? And it goes. Wow, it was that fucking simple. See how long it stays red for, though. Yeah, I don't know why it's staying red. Is it because the train's here? I don't know. Keeping an eye on what we spoke about earlier, it's currently at 380. What's a free day? No. Sorry, I'm looking forward to returning. Yeah, it doesn't work now. But maybe if we move the train forward. No. It's just stuck red now. It's denying its own access, it looks like. It's denying your weapon's parts. Put a third signal on the bottom You're a of the train to go up. It doesn't seem to want to work. Brio requests a cool and fun gazir fact. What kind of facts do you want to know? I don't. I don't know if I've ever said that for for when Brio was present. But but freshly hatched gazirs waddle to the nearest ocean like sea turtles. <laughs> but old wolf, you're hot all the time. You're a goddamn fetch. Goddamn. Okay, so it went past. Then it went red again. You went red. Unless it expects another signal further up to clear the route. Well, it can be like the train is back here, so up here is fine. I, I don't know. There's any fact, res, I don't care. All right. Um, okay, so it looks like just putting a single real signal on any track fucks up the entire track. Well, it make, that that makes me wonder then if it's if it's accurate to say that it needs another signal further back to let the other signals know that it hasn't passed that spot yet. Therefore, anything beyond that point is clear, you know what I mean? Any res, res why are your fluids like Nuka-Cola Quantum? We've been over this before. 
At least I'm pretty sure I have. I think we discussed that due to excess neon in the air, but you are but you kind of iffy on it. Yeah, that, that was a very different bad. planet. Do gazeers have closed air conditioning? They may. Do they have? Do they have freon? Freon. What's that? That's what. Uh, that's what a lot of cars use to make their AC function. And refrigerators, I believe. A res phone. Res has a little teeny tiny pencil eraser, wee wee. No. -uh. Stop is inaccessible from position. Sorry, this is frustrating me a little bit. Yeah, I think I know why. Maybe. I don't know. Because he's frustrated? No follower emotes? There are follower emotes. Is that engine being there stopping it? The one on the left? I don't understand how. That engine is apparently close enough to make that signal think it's obstructing the path. It's a potential risk to the strain. Try putting another signal towards the end of the curve. Which curve? Um, like to the left of the mining vehicle. It's just kind of sitting there. No path. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it can't get back out. Maybe it went in front of the train then? Closer? Something is preventing that signal from clearing the train to go back around the way it came. Never did catch that fun fact. Um, fun facts about Riz. I'm trying to think of one that we haven't spoken about.
Um... Well, favorite recreational activity. Well, for male gazers, that probably would be <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> What's the male gazers' favorite recreational activity? Well, besides the obvious one, uh, probably <laughs> fighting in the arena. I would say. I mean, that depends on if you deem that a favorable thing for them. They ultimately gain something at the end, but their only reason, the reason to do it is via incentive. It's not like they go out of their way to do it, they do it because they get they gain out of it. Favorite Rick Fish like to be then? I don't know, I've never really thought about it. If, if it's not the arena, then the red probably will just be banging. No path. I don't understand. This is the. I I want to believe what it needs is another signal that clears the signal that clears the train in the opposite yeah. direction. Now it wants a single slice of craft, single cheese. I'll kill you. Nah, you wouldn't do that. I suppose. To survive a hell of attack, tell them. But now they're all green and they're not doing, and it's not doing anything. Well, what the hell? Now they're red. Christ. I don't understand. Google Factorial Train Crossing. Maybe the, the station needs to be down. I found a picture. It, like, literally can't be more simple than this. Jesus. Alright, what's the solution? Just... basically one on every side. Except it won't let me place one up here. Where it wants me to place it before. I mean, there's nowhere there's nowhere for a train to go if it goes that way. Maybe I need to finish the fucking railway then? It's popsicle. I don't know how rails work. Apparently I don't either. Game tried to sneak a meteor impact into that. It failed. It's 
such a fucking annoying thing to try and build. Well, how's everyone in chat doing, anyway? People still enjoying the fucking... I think I understand it. You think? No. I just don't have enough signals. Dang. Doing alright, just looking? No worries. I'm tired. So... The distance between each section, the distance between each signal is a block of track. If there's already a train in it, the train is not allowed to move. And because the track, the, because the track loops back around in itself and the block doesn't stop early enough, the train sees itself as on the same block as itself and refuses to move. It's stupid, but that's probably what's happening. So you just need more signals to tell the other signals further down the train hasn't made it that far yet. Well, why did the signals start tattling on each other like that? Kind of a bitch move, if you ask me. But I don't know where to put the signals. Is the thing. I don't know what orientation they need to be in, nor what the uh, real chain signals do. Just put them along the track in front of the turn, both behind and in front of where the train would be. Like what? What needs? What, what it needs to be is a set of defined blocks that the train can be within and not within, so that way the signal knows where the train is actually at. Not within is very speak. So, like that, do you think? That's the basic idea, yeah. Cause like th these, these are these all face, well, these all go upward, right? They're all so. The these two here are going down the way, but these ones are going mm. up the way because they have to. It has to turn around. Yeah. I'm gonna go to the toilet. I'll be back. Okay. Is it too early for the turnaround ones to be put here? I mean, worst case scenario, if it is, just add a couple more sections along the loop. Basically, you just want enough signals. It's got no path, though. Why wouldn't it have a path at all? Well, okay, I deleted those ones. So I think... Let's see. Why is it stopping there? Uh oh. Is so, that is that engine considered an obstruction right now? Let me add a. Let me add another signal then and see. Wherever the signal is. So all I should need to do is put a signal before the train, and I'll be like, oh, okay. That's how it could be, yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's probably... That's probably what was... <laughs> probably part of what was causing it. Right, now once this unloads, it should hopefully go back to the beginning. And then we can test it with a wagon on the middle. Yeah, this at the very least should be blocked out enough that there shouldn't be any overlapping going on. Yeah, and once the train is fully um, decked out, we can see how long the train's going to be and adjust the rails, the, the, the signals there. Unless any quit. part of the train is, is within the box, it'll stop it. Yeah. Well, like if a train is in between these two signals, Yeah. Yeah. What the fuck's wrong now? Um... Mm. 
I don't know. God, I hope nobody who actually understands this is watching. <laughs> this one's red. Put one further back on the loop. Further back, like over here somewhere. I don't understand. Okay, so there's a blue line on this loop, which in indicates it's it's its own block, right? That the the, the different color is a block, which means the game recognizes this as its own separate thing. I can't see that. You might be able to see if you're holding a real uh, signal. Yeah, probably because I'm not holding a real signal. Even deleting that one doesn't do anything. Because it thinks that the side bits are also the same block. Okay, so that's, that's the blue block. Right, so there's the blue block. Figure this out eventually. Understand what these colors are supposed to mean either. Like it seems to flip where I can put it and can't put it. It's not that simple. Why why can't I not just be like a fucking sensor? It's like, oh if there's something in front of it, stop. Because fuck you, that's why. Maybe it's because the fucking rail all the way back here. Or did we get rid of them? So that's gone. Like, I, I can't imagine that you need to put rails all across the entire network just to do one crossing. Because it's, this, it's not possible for this train to go on the other lines because there's no turn. I 
where are we going wrong? Because we have all green lights here. Right, so there's a gif oh. here of someone doing it with four crossings in one. So it's like four plus signs fused together. And they only have two colors. They can only see two colors for their blocks. Which I assume means we only need to see two colors as well. I think I get it. Because we want the ammo train to stop. Let me try... Let me try this. Okay, everything's blue again. Alright, see you, Brio. Take care. Well then. Fuck's sake. <laughs> I think that's my first day. I was looking at the fucking instructions. There's no button to just take all. But right, the gift I was looking at. It seemed to be just... The train's covering part of it up. It was just two. They have two signals, that's all they have. Like this. So, sorry. I don't know, fuck you then. I'm just looking at the. Okay, so they have it. The train is going in this direction. They have one of these. Mm -hmm. and then on the other side, it looks like it's flipped. Like this. Mm -hmm. So let's try that. Yeah, it's symmetrical. I know it's not symmetrical. <laughs> okay, it can move. That's a that's a good sign. Yeah, but this actually this makes sense when I look at it. I still don't understand it. Well, the way I'm interpreting that. Okay, now it's green. Yeah, it's because it's because this There's, train was beyond this stuff. point. Good. But the way I interpret it is because the train was beyond this point, and there's no other signals to mark it. It was like no other trains come up this way because there's already a train up here in this block. Maybe we just weren't using the signals correctly. Because now, the upward route is marked as clear, and this one, because it's a separate block, this one is red now, because the train's down here, so it's like, hey, no other trains come down this way. So if this so breaks, I have no idea what the fuck I'm talking about. Oh, it can't, because there's no power. Oh, well... When the hell did that happen? Oh, okay. Let's see. Am I just spewing bullshit? Or am I actually reading this correctly? Let's find out. 
Well, it's left, so it's gone. Okay, so yeah, there we go. I guess we just weren't combining the signals properly. Right, now let's try it with the wagon on it. Well, it changed signal, so... Yeah, that's, that's working as intended. All right, that was a fucking bollock. But what happens if I put oh, I the guess. train down on? Where is the train? Oh, it's in my pocket. Oh, that completely locks down the track. Put the solid fuel back in. So the train just being here is not good for us. Presumably, if you were to put another signal, a signal pairing like this, facing this way, somewhere like in this area, it would tell these others that this section of track is actually fine, because that train is beyond this point. But how do we do that? Let me craft one of those. Yeah. All right, I want to do it. Yeah, that is how it works. All right, but then if anything's on this side of the train, it will happen again as well. Yeah, that's why we would put another one just like this on the opposite side. Oh! Jesus. I wish this would go a little slower. Fuck. Okay, yeah. So th those are supposed to be paired together. We just weren't doing it right. Well, let's see if the train can still get here. Right, it's left, and that's just a good sign. Oh. oh. It stops. Now moves, and you're on the train track. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Thing is so <laughs> stupid. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> that thing was just fucking flying off the track. I feel like we have these a little sooner than we probably really needed them. <laughs> <laughs> I actually need... Where are they? Cliff Explosives. Can I have my train back? Can we both pop on it? Or no? We can now. Right. I need... Clef explosives, because then I can destroy clefs in the way of the train. 
I still need to recreate this damn tank. <laughs> I need um like eight more big electric motors for that purpose. Well, you know how to make them. I know how to make them. It's just that I'm lacking in the small motors. Oh, well, you can just and craft those, those by hand. Produced. Well, fuck you, then. <laughs> Okay, so for cliff explosives, I need an empty barrel. Um, not quite sure how to make an empty barrel. Oh, there it is. Imagine how stupid I felt when I found out that I could craft over a hundred of them by hand. Small motors? Motors, yeah. <laughs> we are producing grenades somewhere. Where is the grenades? I think they're all being fed into the research facilities. I just need a few. Actually, apparently I can just make them look cool. It's surprisingly easy. Like, you can- you too can make a fragmentation grenade with your bare hands. I think Sev has drowned. He's fallen in. You know what I've been thinking about that makes me feel kind of stupid? What? You know how it says those advanced signals read the signals up ahead? Yeah. You think without those, the, <laughs> the signals have no idea what the hell's going on. So th this chain signal is looking ahead at this real signal here. Yeah, that's that's the point, which makes me... F I feel like the description of those is a little misleading because they don't sound that important. Like, you might not need them for something basic like that when it appears you do because without them the signals didn't seem to bother contacting each other yeah I don't know well we got it working now so we're the smartest Factorio players alive. <laughs> Here goes an hour and a half. But crafting the tank. Yeah, it took a while. There's so much shit in the way of building trains. <laughs> I say that and then I just get to a good, nice stretch of land. Alright. Um, I am pretty much between 
both of it those. It looks like he went a little further than you needed to be. Yeah. There's a cliff in the way, but you're looking at about right here. Yeah, I'm right in the middle, so I set up two factories here. Mining the shit out of coal. And I'll make my first patrol in the new vehicle down that way, since it's going to be vulnerable until it's more well established. It's gonna be a big, big coal train. So you're gonna need one hell of a station to offload all that shit. I yeah. The how fucking slow it is to start up as well. It's a slow. Yeah, look it how slow that is. It doesn't even need to go that like it's the fucking the length of the train is probably like a quarter of the actual route. Are we building trains for too short of distances? It might be too short of distances now, but I feel like it would be really... It'll become easier to just expand the rail network as needed. And we can just deprecate rails that we don't need anymore. Yeah. Personally, I feel it lays a good foundation for what's to come. Because it means that we can keep bringing back resources to the same places. My dog barking in the background. I couldn't even hear that. Yeah, so the train actually covers up, well, the train station would be covered up by this transport belt. Which means I need to move the transport belt down. Sure. There's also this, this robo-port in the way as well now. I wonder if, uh... It's linked together with the other roboports, and I don't know if that's done automatically or if that has to be done by hand. Sure. No, Seb says he's been laying spring robo ports about. No, right. yeah, I'm just... not waiting on that. I wonder if I need to. I probably need to move that to get the train station going.
I need a drink. Where is my drinkies? Let's try drinkies. <laughs> I'm looking at the uh, the factory around Seb's core drill, and there's limited space for other resources because the copper's full, so it's just spinning mostly copper ore around in a circle, waiting for more space to be freed up. <laughs> Yeah, copper... It's surprising how much copper you get and how little copper is used. My back hurts. Suffer. <laughs> In fact, I already ate some of I thought my voice was already ASMR. Oh, I need... Apparently we can make laser cannon batteries. Nice. You ain't talking much, the game takes really. Oh, we can finally build that, um... That flying thing. It needs big, more uh, big electric motors though. The flying thing. The the PLOPC apparently is what it's called, and we know it's about the laser tank now as well. Nice. Don't know if the laser tank is going to be better than the atomic tank. I mean. I imagine an atomic tank might be a little more damaging potentially than a laser tank but that would that would mainly be attributed to the whole atomic thing it has going on the atomic tank that does look be... more expensive actually how much is a battery a big battery sulfuric acids and so they're about equal what about an atomic laser tank well then everything would burn What's your vision of an atomic laser tank? Like, a laser that just causes an atomic detonation upon impact? The Death Star. In tank form? Yep. Look, they put it on Star Destroyers, it's only a matter of time before everyone's just carrying a fucking Death Star in their pocket. Oh, I guess. My wildest dream tank. Flame tank. Oh god, I fucking hated using those things. I hate fighting against them too. Christ. Damn flame tanks. Um. I don't know. Honestly, when it comes to that, it's just that's the first thing that comes to mind is just sheer practicality. Like think think uh like a GDI mammoth tank. The walking one or the the treaded one? The treaded one. It's like super heavily armored, double barreled, 
for increased damage and it can protect itself from aircraft. What's not to love about that? My dream tank. Uh, the Marv. Marv. I don't know, Chief. No, I, I have, I have a, I have a difficult time with fantasy. Like I can accept an established world just fine in that context, but no. Also, the Marv, as it comes, unmodified, kind of sucks, if I'm going to be honest. Would still be far more advanced than anything today. Advanced, of course. Plus, I assume I'm getting to choose the attachments. No. No. I just get four engineers and that's it. <laughs> Like whenever, whenever I put out a Marv, like I just wanted to put four, four missile troops in there so it could defend itself against aircraft. Otherwise, it'll just sit there and take it all day. Like you. I don't really appreciate what you're insinuating. <laughs> I am a fan of versatility. I don't like any one thing being particularly helpless. What would be your what would what aircraft from a game would you have then? He's in deep thought. Well, I haven't really seen all that many aircraft in games that aren't just like, oh, here's our version of an F-15. Would you take a Pelican from Halo? And at the end of the day, that's just a transport. So you want it to be something a bit more. What's the uh what's what's the UNSC like airborne Uber unit in Halo Wars? Is that the vulture? Yeah, the vulture. I like that. Did I hear Sav there? He read up briefly. I'm not sure if that was because he's back. He must or be if talking to someone. Sev is moving around. Oh, is he back? Sev? Sev? I didn't have much to say, so I was not saying it. No. Warm. Very warm. It is warm. Oh. 
turn off the sun. Considering it's always a midnight, not really an option. Yeah, it's almost oh. midnight. Oh yeah, it's now until midnight. Well, we've been going for going for three and a bit hours, so maybe we should call it there. All right, I suppose. You that there is to need. Three chibi doki for the funsies. Apparently, the zero's idol just went live. <laughs> we'll read them. They didn't work for me. What a coincidence. No, all right. No, guys. Uh, thank you all very much for watching. Thank you for your support. If you guys haven't already, please do consider following and subscribing. Uh, join the Discord server. Let's you guys know whenever I go live. And I will see you guys all next time. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.